What's up, people? It's your boy, Jetwine. I'm here with a different jetpack. Now, the last one I made was the Jetback Jetpack. And this one, I actually found some newer technologies in there from Kerbal Foundries and decided, hey, I'm going to make a smaller, more maneuverable, and more agile jetpack. And ended up with this one, the fan jetpack thing. I don't know the name, and I don't know. I, I, I don't know. But anyhow, <laughs> we're going to take this thing out for a flight. Now, I was able to do quite a few things with this during the design phase. So, we're going to see if I can uh, get this thing, one, off the ground. Good. Alright. So, I hit one, and that should put me into hover mode. Because Kerbal Foundries has hover mode in, in, installed in a lot. It's implemented in a lot of its parts. So, that being said... Now it should maintain our hover. Uh, that is actually really nice because now I can do different things like this. I just got to be careful what I'm doing here so I don't screw anything up. And I should be able to quickly approach the space center, uh, giving Jebediah a nice controlled view, unlike the other jetpack that did not have a very good controlled approach method. So this one is actually really nice because I can control a lot of this a lot better than I could previously. And we need to slow the hell down. Whoa, buddy. All right, all right. So now that we're here, we can actually start to uh, gently stop ourselves in midair here. And uh, see if we can, uh, come on. Breaks, breaks. All right, there we go. And a little over to the side, and now you can see we're kind of we're pretty stable right here. So we can actually use this time here to take a nice look around the space center, and it gives us a nice unparalleled view of the space center. We can pretty much get to any real angle we want and do this uh it's actually a pretty good challenge when you're flying in between everything now if i did this right nope nope two will two actually lifts my hover up whereas three would lower it down so what i need to do now is gently ever so carefully start to move myself through here and hopefully i can do this just right uh, let's go down a little bit more. Whoa, 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 uh, whoa, 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 do I get points for a recovery? Do I get points? Oh, I can't see anything. Ooh, whoa. Okay, okay, nice and easy, nice and easy. Gentle movements. I need to make gentle movements. That is what I was not doing right there. So I need to press caps lock to kind of do that now. So, hey, there we go. Ah, well, that was a little stressful. Okay, so now we got now we got a little groove going. Now we got a little groove. Uh, I wonder if we can fly through here if we're too high or not. Uh, or is it going to lift me up? Is it going to lift me up? Ooh. Oh. <laughs> we did it we did it all right let's get up a little bit <laughs> holy smoly i didn't think that would work i didn't think that would work um so i'm actually very thrilled that it did work so i will take that <laughs> uh i am very happy that that actually did work i've never tried that out Alright, so we're still just kind of nice and easy flying over the station. Uh, we need to go ahead and kick back this way. And that should give us all this. Let's go ahead and raise ourselves up a little bit more. Now what I want to do, I'm going to try to land somewhere I haven't landed before. So I'm actually going to come over here to the space plane hangar and see if I can nail a landing here. So let me get my gear out already. And uh, 
start to slow myself down a little bit and bring myself down bring myself down uh, down some more back 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 over back get back come on you can do it come on over down alright and coming on down some more and down 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 ho beautiful landing <laughs> so there you go we are landed here on top of the space plane hangar where I have never landed before did a maneuver I've never tried before and, and built a craft that I've tried a few times and had absolute terrible time with previously but uh, this time around I've gotten a lot better control of it but this is the fan bag jet pack and hopefully you enjoyed it now if you did drop me in a comment let me know what you think I'll try to upload the uh, craft file so other people can try it out as well this one does use Kerbal Foundries and it also uses Impossible Innovations and Tweak Scale along with Umbra, uh, uh, their exploration pack. So it does have quite a few mods integrated in here. And it allows it to have a really unparalleled flight time uh, since these engines here actually are electric. And I have a slightly tweaked out version that I'm using here of the PB Nukes in the back that allow me to to power these so uh, it's not a chain I just modified I actually copied their uh, the PB nukes and made a high output version to use for little things like this that's close quarters that's close quarters awesome <laughs> awesome all right, all right, all right. Let's go and visit another building here. Ah. Ah. <laughs> now that's the way to land. That's the way to land. That is the way to land. Look at that right there. Yes! Ha <laughs> ha! That's so awesome! Okay, I got this. We got this. We got this. You know what? I bet you we could sneak this through there. If we are careful enough. Uh, we probably could. If we're careful enough. If not, we're gonna mess everything up and... Bump off of it! That was great. I was expecting a harder impact, but that actually did the trick pretty well. Uh, so let's counter all of this. Alright, here we go. We got this. We got it, we got it.
<laughs> oh, that is fantastic. That is fantastic. So, if you like what you're seeing, definitely drop me in the comment below. Hit that like button. Let me know what you think. Share this out to your friends. See what you can create. Nice miniaturized craft with your, ba your favorite mods. Uh, see if you can get some nice control balance out of it. And if you want to fly it, I'll drop the craft file in. And hopefully, I'll drop a link in the description below once it's available. And until the next time, I hope to catch you guys in the next video. This is your boy, Jatwan. I'm out. Peace. Go ahead and toggle our SAS. Kick our engines down to zero. And now we're going to use Kerbal Foundry's hover pods to kind of lift, our, lift ourselves. Oh, oh, oh. oh, all right. We're going to do it real quick and get a, a first-person view. And then we're going to go for a landing.